Good morning, everyone. I hope you guys are all having a blessed day. Uh, mine's going pretty good. Hey, uh, I wanted to talk to you about a couple things this morning, especially uh, the first one is people actually believe that they can fool God. This is what it says. It says, Thou knowest my downsitting and my uprising. Thou understandest my thoughts afar off. Thou compasses my path and my lying down, and are acquainted with all my ways. For there is not a word in my tongue, but thou, O Lord, thou knowest it all together. You know, I love the fact that God knows everything about me. He knows every fiber of my being. Matter of fact, God knows me better than I know myself. It's what allows me to have a pure relationship with Him. The fact that he knows everything. Nothing is hidden. There's no way that I can lie to him. He's the one person that I have to be honest with. Not everyone believes that. There are people that believe that they can actually con God. There are people that believe that God cannot read their minds. They believe they can fool God just like they fool all the other people in their lives. They believe he's no different. This is what it says in verse 17. It says, How precious are thy thoughts unto me, O God! How great is the sum of them! If I should count them, they are more in number than the sand of the sea. When I awake, I am still with thee. You know what? I am constantly amazed. I am just amazed that God knows me through and through every fiber of my being. And yet he still loves me with a love that I will never understand. That blows me away. What that proves to me is that I have value. And it also proves to me that God loves me absolutely unconditionally with a love that I will never understand. Verse 23 says, Search me, O God, and know my heart. Try me and know my thoughts. And see if there be any wicked way in me. And lead me into the way of everlasting. People, this fact that God knows you through and through and that he loves you anyway. That is the reason that we should forsake all sin and try to serve him with every fiber of our being. That's the reason why. God has given me absolutely everything. I, he literally opened up the windows of heaven and has poured out a blessing on me my entire life. He's done that, and yet I deserve absolutely nothing. He's given me everything, and I deserve nothing. You know, I love the fact that God knows me through and through. Every single fiber He knows. And I know that God is working in me to mold me into being the creature that he created me to be. I am his son. I am a child of light, a child of the day. God is molding me into being the creature that he created me to be. People listen. You can't fool God. He knows everything. You can't pull the wool over his eyes. You can't con him. He sees it all and he knows it all. And he loves you anyway. That should be reason enough for you to serve him. Anyway, I just want to give you something to think about. Heaven or hell you choose. Just remember, once you take your last breath, it's a done deal.